Hey, what's up everyone? It's Simon Chan. I'm here to fire you up and get you going because we all know we need some motivation like the way we need oxygen. Hey, it is Friday. Hey, today I want to talk about opportunities and what they mean. Okay, I talk about opportunities. And uh, before we start, hey, today, hey, I'm I'm enjoying this journey with you. I, it is 30, 47 days until the book launch, uh, and we just dropped a goodie. Hey, I'm giving out free updates and little cool little stuff, exclusive stuff from the book. Um, if you aren't part of the book club, drop in club in the comments, and I'll send it out to you. But we got 47 days left. All right, today let's talk a little bit about... Uh, anyway, how are you all doing? Let me get a check there. Bob, how, how has your week been? Today it is, by the way, we got a social media workshop. I didn't, we got so much stuff going on. I totally forgot about that. Uh, anyway, for those who are watching on Instagram, welcome to today's pep talk. I'm here to fire you up and get you going because, uh, you know, we all need some motivation. But how was your week? Today's a lot of stuff going on. We got our social media workshop coming up in a couple hours. This is the last one I'll be doing until after the book launches until August. So definitely go check it out. Drop in workshop in the comments and I'll send it out to you. So uh, let me give you some shout outs. Carl, good to see you. A uh, scale week to 10, eight and a half. How's your week been? My week has definitely been um, nine in terms of productivity, getting ready. Got a lot of cool stuff for the book launch. Um, and I'll give you a clue. Should I give you this clue? Yeah, let's, let's do it. Hey, I'm doing a party, a virtual party for a book launch. We do a lot of cool stuff, give away prizes, um, some very cool stuff I've never done before. And we're actually, you know, I'm doing it at four different times, four different parts. So it doesn't matter what time zone you're at, whether you're in Minnesota, you're in London, you are in Abu Dhabi, you're in Philippines, Australia, Melbourne, Sydney. Hey, I got you covered. Okay, we're going to be a long, long day party. There's going to be really a lot of fun on that day. So uh, let me see. That's uh, Carrie. Good to see that you have a great week nine. And it's important. It, today is April 22nd, right? Doesn't matter your company is paying you weekly or monthly. I want you to push hard and finish strong. Okay. Uh, create that culture, the habit, the routine. Hey, you can relax on Saturday. You can relax on Sunday. But until Fridays, you push hard until the final bell. Create that culture for and, and that's what basically what uh, um my mentor helped me out with called friday night madness you want to hang out hang on saturday but we always push hard to the final bell until uh, saturday morning well what whatever your cut off your company is but having a culture hey and then relax on saturday sunday plan on your week and then monday you go hard again all right make sure you do that um janet hey five for business but keep pushing it is only in the morning you still got 12 more hours left. Make sure every hour counts. All right. Today, we're talking about opportunities, right? Since we're talking about pushing things, you know, most lucky, and in this business, you need luck. I'll be a church buyer. You do need luck, okay? And I got lucky. I recruit some uh, pretty smart network people better than me. And that's the key. You always want people who are more successful than you and better network than you. Lindsay, good to see you. Hey, go out there, find someone who's smarter than you and more bigger network than you. That's the key to the part of the business, who you can grow fast. Otherwise, it, the growth is gonna be very, very small, right, slow. So you gotta get lucky, then where do you find these people, right? And where do you, he, here's something, you know, we talked about luck uh, the other day, where luck is hard, we, hard work meets opportunity. But you have to understand, most lucky events in life are opportunities not outcomes people think when you're lucky it's like whoa i got he, he got lucky he won the lotto right that's like an outcome but luck really in life is an opportunity if you think about if i go back to my journey uh most of the times i got lucky it wasn't because of i'm i i, I achieved this or i got that it's because of an opportunity i had i got lucky okay i got lucky our company opened up in malaysia at the right time in the second year, um, year and a half into the business, I found out about it. That was luck. The luck was also after that I opened up, uh, uh, made up all the mistakes I could in Malaysia. Was it two and a half years later, opened up in Philippines. And by then I was way more experienced. So the, the, my success in the Philippines wasn't luck. It was the opportunity that was luck. So most lucky events are opportunities. Think about the opportunities you run across today. So. When I say opportunity, I'm not talking about like a business opportunity. Right now, I'm talking about opportunity to grow your business. Could be the person you meet at an event, right? Or 
the um, opportunity to post to social media and someone engaged on it that didn't before. You're posting a story and five new people watched it, right? These are opportunities. Luck. Like the value of an opportunity changes depending well, on the value of opportunity changes depending on how you treat it. If you work hard, stay focused at it, then good luck, you know, can be a life-changing event, right? If you, without effort, uh, not putting much time, it's a wasted opportunity. I share with you a luck, the opportunity. One of the keys to success for me in Philippines was, and I ended up growing a team of over 100,000 people there. Okay, I even lost track how big, how big the team. Someone told me uh, 95% of the company's earnings come from my downline, just from that country. But the, I didn't get lucky. I found a person lucky, but the luck was really the opportunity. I had to do a meeting at midnight one night. Okay, I still remember this was back in September 2008. I had to do a meeting, business presentation in Glendale, which is a, a suburb in Los Angeles, at midnight to a, to this lady and uh, some of this, this lady Shane and her husband was watching Manila. Now I was actually her husband Ed was actually going to meet him. I had done Facebook advertising was opportunity was way way back then. Found a, a lot of people, but one guy I was going to set up meetings in Manila, but had a wife in Los Angeles wanting to meet at, mid, at midnight on Saturday. So uh, with her brother. And so that was luck. That was the lucky, and th that's an example of lucky event in life is an opportunity, not the outcome. Now, could have been that this will led to nothing, sure. But as you ended up being, a, uh, her, her husband was a huge leader. Shane is a leader as well. End up leading to building a team of 100,000 100, people. All right. Now, I've also done things where I met people where it led to nothing. I also did a meeting at 3 a.m. in Philippines where it led to nothing. A lot of stories where it led to nothing. But all you need is one. So, I want you to keep an eye out there, right? Luck is opportunities. The opportunities in your life are your lucky chances. But when you get these opportunities, go focus and stay hard, work hard, stay consistent with that. The opportunity, lucky opportunity could be that one person that, I don't know, reply back to you. Could be an opportunity to chat with them. Could be an opportunity to go do something in your community. Whatever it is, that is your luck. And at that moment, a lot of times, you don't realize this luck. You may think, oh, I can't believe I'm doing this. Okay, I can't, you, it doesn't even make sense. So anyway, that's my message for you. It's a long, longer message. I want you to think hard about those opportunities. Uh, opportunities is luck, absolute Terry. Hey, we got a social media workshop. Uh, hey, that, that could be luck for you. I don't know. It could be. Could be luck for me. Could be luck for you. Could be me helping the next person get, get a sign up by Monday. I don't know, but we have a social media workshop today. Even if you can't make it, there will be a recording. Drop a workshop in the comments. I'll send it out to you. I don't know. Good to see you, my friend. Keep crushing it. And also, for those who are not in the free Consistently Book Club, drop in club in the comments. Tag someone. And we got new goodie drops coming next week. And also prizes as well. All right, everyone. Um, you know what, Janet? You're looking for few who lead you to others. Absolutely. And I'll give you one more thing. Is when you're looking for people who are leading to follow, you never know who. There are some people who you think will be ready to be led. They say they are. They're not. And then the ones who you least expect are. And that was a surprise for me as well. All right. Uh, you know, Carrie, I think is being blessed. Absolutely, I think is being blessed as well. Some people call it blessing. Some people call it luck. I actually like the word blessing as well better. Uh, but people just think a lot of times the reason I say luck is you got to be lucky to be, be successful. You absolutely have to be. There's some luck involved. Uh, but luck is where hard work meets opportunity. Go keep grinding. Go keep staying consistent. And Rebecca, go make it happen, everyone. Have an awesome weekend. And I hope to see you at the workshop. Okay, drop a workshop in the comments. I'll send you the details. I got to go. I got to prepare for it. Got a lot of good stuff coming on. Hey, everyone. Get lucky. Stay consistent. Stay focused. Have a positive impact on someone's life. God bless. Looking forward to see you at the workshop. Take care.